And, and because of that, I think there are so many Africans, young and old, who have just realized that you can change how you see the world. You, 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 you can unravel this, the, the, the package of your world view and put it back together again without, you know, combusting in the process. Um, and in fact, we've come out the other side as as better people, as stronger people. You know, with with Nelson Mandela as as the uh, the icon of what that looks like. A lot of people uh, are worried about things that really you shouldn't be worried about. Um, and it, it it's it's when those bigger issues kind of implode in on top of you that you suddenly realise, oh, okay, there there are bigger things in the world, and my little day to day worries, are, you know, are not worries. Yeah. And and so that's helpful, you know. Give yourself that bigger perspective. Don't don't get caught in the bottle, you know. Don't don't build a cocoon around you. Do exactly the opposite. Yeah. The, the cocoon feels safer. It feels nicer, uh, but that's a short term uh, solution. Uh, you know, the bigger term solution is to step out. Um, so it's change is not a problem, but change that is unexpected or change that is unknown or change that we can't control, that's the thing that freaks us out. Right. And again, I think those of us who, in, 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 in great, to a greater or a lesser extent, have been thrown into situations where we had no control over the change that happened to us, yeah. have realized that, yeah, well, we, we've said it again, it, it provides a perspective, it provides an opportunity, and, and you get to choose how to take that opportunity or not.